Just, I mean, you send anything for the F, to the into the FPPC, it doesn't matter what it is, they have to look at it. Fair, FPPC meaning Fair Political Fair Practices. Political Practice, Practices Commission. Okay. And so actually, so you, you know, he, they, he sent something in saying that I made violations, and within two days the FPPC responded saying no, no violations were made, and 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 there is there is nothing that we're going to open an investigation on. Okay. So then, so then, what ends up happening is that the Whittier Daily News breaks a story about, you know, so the DA looking in, and inquiring into investigation uh, about Mr. Bermudez and his legality to run in this district because he is not a resident in this, in this district. <laughs> his, he, welcome to welcome to the summer of love. You're right. You know his. His home is in Sacramento, his retirement goes to Sacramento, his wife is a teacher in Sacramento schools, his kids attend private schools in Sacramento and play soccer okay, and soccer he, he clubs in Sacramento. He's with his parents who are in their 80s. Yeah, he would right. be, okay. Right, right. I'm, I'm 26, so, you know, if I was living with my parents, it'd be somewhat believable, but he's 52, 54 years old. And he's been living there since August. Uh, of this year, yeah. August of this year. Okay. This year. Last year. Well, exactly. 2011. Yeah. 20, it was we're in 2012, right? Yeah, okay. Yeah. yeah. Well, we're regardless, you know. So, Ian, how can the voters get in contact with you? My website, iancalderon2012.com. Okay. And you can leave a comment, you can send me a message, anything. Or you can go to my Facebook. It's facebook.com forward slash iancalderon2012. Okay, and you also have a campaign headquarters? I do. And where's that at? It is on Greenleaf in Whittier, uh, basically at the Give me the address. 70, 7617 Greenleaf Avenue in Whittier. Okay. And it's basically at the corner of Greenleaf and Mar Vista. And people can come up there and sign up and volunteer and yes. help out if they believe in the cause. Okay. Absolutely. We just we had our campaign kickoff not too long ago. We've been walking and phone banking for almost a month now. We've contacted a lot of people. We're getting a you know a very high percentage in terms of yes rates. And I, I I am out there walking in the community and if you follow me on Twitter and on Facebook you can see the pictures and different videos that we post from when I walk. I was very proud recently, and my mom came out and walked precincts with me, and that's, that, you know. It's kind of the family it's family tradition. It is, it is. 1982, yeah. when my dad ran uh, yeah. for the assembly, his his mom, his my grandmother, you know, walked door to door with him, and to have my mom doing it and, and involved, I mean, it means a lot to have, have your family support you 110%. You definitely need yeah. to have a family behind you when you run for any office. I don't care if it's jet <laughs> dog catcher. We, we, we should be electing the dog catcher, by the way. Do you yes. have any uh, siblings? I do. I have several siblings. I have uh, the youngest is Brennan. He's my half brother, seven years old. Uh, then my one full brother Matt, who is 24. Then I have a step brother Stephen. He is 27, just turned 27. And then I have two uh, half brothers, both in their 30s, as well as a stepsister in her 30s. And then you have a as a, as a cousin Cameron Calderon. Yes. And Cam's running for central committee, right? Yes. Uh, Cameron is you know he's he's Thompson. He's Thompson. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, we had your head Uncle Tom in here a couple weeks ago, and he was, gave us a great interview about his water board race, so it was really fun. Yeah. So, Ian, thanks. This has been great. Yeah. We really appreciate your time, and uh, best of luck to you. I appreciate it. I, I really do. Keep up, that, keep up that fight, man. This is great <laughs> stuff for us, honestly, into the, uh, into, the, into the campaign, being able to cover it. And we certainly appreciate you taking the time to come out and talk to us today. Thank you. I appreciate it, Ian. Thanks so much. All right. Thank good you. luck to you. Thank you. Yeah. That's all.